In this installment, we'll be taking a look at the construction of the top-of-the-range Colnago EPS frame. The bare tubes have to be prepared before frame construction can begin, and the first step is to mitre the ends of the tubes using a mitre cutting machine. This relatively simple machine shapes the end of the tube in such a way that it will fit up against the next tube in the frame. This is done to allow maximum overlap of the tubing into the special lugs that they'll then be inserted into after trimming to length. Depending upon the frame size, the tubes are then cut to the desired length before having a mitre cut into the other end of the tube. Batches of tubes are prepared and then stored on shelves. This way there will always be a ready stock of tubing to begin frame building allowing Colnago to react to orders within minutes. To begin construction of the frame, all of the parts required are collected together, and the frame tubing and lugs have their surfaces inspected and prepared for the bonding process. A unique type of bonding agent, a kind of glue, is used to join the tubes into the lugs that will join all of the tubes together. The tubes are supplied to Colnago from the manufacturers ATR, who are based in Colonella, Italy. Colnago's tubing is filament wound around stainless steel mandrels and made to some of the highest standards in the world of carbon composite manufacturing. Colnago's tubing is unique not only in the layup of the carbon composite fibers but also due to its internal structure. The tubes are then placed into a frame jig in order. All of the tubes and the lugs are clamped down, with alignment taking place at every step to ensure that the finished frame is perfectly straight. Once this process is complete, an oven is placed around the jig to cure the bonding agent and permanently join the tubes to the lugs, creating a complete bicycle frame. After the required cooking time, the frame is left to cool in the jig to ensure it remains perfectly straight. Once removed from the jig, some surfaces are then prepared by hand before special jigs are used to drill all of the holes required for frame fittings to be installed. Each frame then has the head tube machined before being inspected for alignment. After this stage, the frame fittings are installed by hand. Cable stops and the front mech brazon are fitted, after which the frame is ready for painting.